32-year-old robbery with undefeated Notre Dame. The Irish return the ball to their own 25-yard line. Hangsman carries for Notre Dame, and it's a fumble. Gerald Matter of the Cadets recovers the pigskin. With the game just two minutes old, Army's Glenn Davis is off on a 26-yard run to score standing up. Army 7, Notre Dame nothing. In the second quarter, West Point's Doc Blanchard smashes through. Army's team, one of the mightiest in football history, can't be stopped. Tucker passes to Glenn Davis. Five enemy tacklers are between Davis and the Notre Dame goal line. But watch this 175-pound back move to that goal line. He's over for Army touchdown number two. Here's that much talked of Army ball handling in slow motion. Poole takes a pass from Tucker. He laterals it to Davis coming up on the outside. It's the military precision that marks the K-Dead attack. A good quarter. Notre Dame's Raderman passes to McGurk. The Irish fight the score at least once against the cadets. Again, Raderman passes. But this time, West Point's Doc Blanchett intercepts, and he's off. Army makes it 16 straight by trouncing Notre Dame 48 to nothing. A never-say-die Notre Dame team tries a desperation pass. Ratterman, about to throw one downfield, finds Doc Blanchard very much in the picture. Watch the interception. Clasping the pigskin to his manly chest, Felix feels that a straight line is the shortest distance between two points and is on his way. A thrilling spectacle for over 75,000 fans. A tough day for the Irish as Army triumphs 48 to nothing. The Irish have no chance to stop Doc Blanchard as he rips through like a pile driver and again sets up a touchdown. And again, it's Davis who carries the mail, slithering through Notre Dame with the ease of a ballet dancer. When the smoke clears, it's Army 48, Notre Dame nothing. 